to it. Next up, Battle Swag, an online edition, everybody. This is week number 43 of the series. It's 2021, a beautiful new year. And thank you all for all the beautiful match arena support and all the good stuff that you guys have done already. Let's jump into it, fellas, and get ready for some great matches tonight. Let me know how everything looks and sounds for you guys at home, fellas. Hopefully everything is good. Good level of audio. You can hear okay. Good quality. And so we're going to have a beautiful tournament tonight. <laughs> this messing around the chat. Some of those are funny. Why is it's cold and not? Oh, that must be for uh, what's her name, right? Colleen, right? It's cold. That's like an option that he has. <laughs> all right, guys, we're going to jump into it very soon, as I said. Thank you all for all of your support. We already have a match lined up for you guys, Chris versus Orange Man, in just a moment. If you guys are watching this, whether you're watching on Twitch or on YouTube, guys, please, if you're enjoying yourselves and you appreciate what we do, please give us a follow. Give us a follow here on Twitch. Give us a follow on YouTube if you're watching this. Whatever else. All you Twitch monsters, by the way, if you're not receiving those special notifications whenever we go live, don't just follow, but also check on that bell. Maybe even, you know, un un turn off those notifications. Turn them back on just to make sure because you want to make sure you get all the goodies. Thanks a lot, fellas. Thanks for all the support. One more look at the bracket and the matches that you can expect tonight, fellas. We got a lot of good ones, and we got two of your favorites. Two of the strongest in the business here, period. We have Idom and we have Punk the God, both attending, guys. So look out for both of them. Should be amazing. We also have, as you can see, especially in round two, we have a lot of your favorites, including Smug is here tonight, guys. Ludovic, OG Yawn, Shine up in here, Dan Slip, Zaffirino and his great Sagat, Rob TV, Flux Waves, Metro M, The Claw Wonder, Joe Umer, Rogue, and Thunder, Brian F. You guys definitely love him, and many more. One more reminder, guys, for all the players. Thanks, Secret. Thanks, bro. Woo! Yeah, thank you, Brian F. That does remind me, by the way, if you guys are streaming yourselves on Twitch tonight, uh, first off, don't forget to tag us at TSpooky on Twitter and let us know with the hashtag NOBC so we can retweet your stream. But also, to all you guys that are watching here on Twitch, don't forget to also check out the category, Street Fighter Five here on Twitch.tv. And once that category, you know, Look it out! Look out for the Street Fighter Five. There we go. I didn't know what I was talking about there for a second. Check out the Street Fighter Five category on Twitch, and look for all the homies that are streaming themselves while they play in OBC. It should be a lot of fun tonight, guys. Stick around, enjoy it. Please check out the Match Arena crowdfund as well if you guys are excited for some great matches. Use that coupon code. Support the players tonight. Thank you, everybody. We got about what three minutes or something like that. I think I ran the intro too early, but that's okay. It gives me a minute to chill and talk to all you guys at home. Yeah, that. That too, that's true. So I haven't mentioned this one yet, guys, but if you guys didn't see it, Capcom actually put out a big notification today uh, from Capcom Europe, though. Crazy, it wasn't Capcom Japan or Capcom USA. It was, Ca was, was it Capcom Japan that put it out? Okay, I found it on the Capcom Europe site. Okay, I see, so that was a translation. Well, anyway, basically they have a new, uh, what do you call it? They have a new set of rules for streaming their content. Is that the best way I can describe it? It's like a, it's like guidelines for streaming their content or for producing their content. It makes a lot of sense to me anyway, if I say it that way. Uh, but, you know, take a peek, guys, especially those of you that are also content creators for Capcom games, not just Street Fighter, but their games in general, uh, because they're going over that quite a lot. And uh, there's, there's a lot involved to it. It doesn't seem like they're trying to stop people from running tournaments or events or anything like that. So if you're just the type that's doing the standard, you know, doing your gameplay on Twitch and talking while you're streaming yourself playing Street Fighter, I think you have absolutely nothing to worry about. Uh, but uh, it does look like they're on the lookout for guys that like to do things like upload the entire story of Devil May Cry the minute the game comes out. I, I don't think they're about that life anyway. Mm-hmm. They, they don't want what? Oh yes, yeah, so they're they're trying to go against mod. That's a good point. Mhm. Mm yep. Okay, I see. So so there's some things about monetization. What's up, Bar? I can hear you now. Sorry about that. Okay, bro. Cool. I had you muted because sometimes you you have your buttons on while you're playing. Yeah. Anime. What's good, bro? How you doing today? Yeah, chilling. Yeah, nah. Like I, I'm not. I think we're in the clear. I heard what you were saying, yeah. Oh, yeah, well, yeah we're like, talking oh, about yeah. this stuff. There's some stuff involving monetization that you guys should be careful about. And then also some guys that really love to upload replays, you might want to watch out because they're like, I don't know. They but but like, the, but, but, here, but, here's, but here's my thing. Does that only apply? Does that only for Street Fighter Five? I'm assuming? No, I, I, this is for everything. 
they're they're concerned about guys uploading story gameplay and Devil May Cry and stuff like that too. No, so I mean everything. I mean I'm not, I'm not, I mean as far as the fighting game replays go. Sorry. I mean I don't to know. To be more I specific, mean, Devil yeah, May yeah, Cry has know. replays too. I don't know what maybe they don't want you to upload your replay of yourself doing crazy virtual combos and Devil May Cry without commentary. Who knows? It's kind of it's kind of ambiguous, but I, I guess we'll see. Yeah, I think the mods one that makes a lot of sense. I think that might probably. Oh yeah, I'm ready. I guess let's start it up, Art. You're here. Let me move to the yeah, back. Yeah, I'm, I'm, I'm here. I'm, I'm in the back, cool, right? Bro. Sweet. Let's um, do it, fellas. Let's get into this first match, guys. Thanks for all the support. Thanks for following and all that good stuff. And uh, feel free to talk about this today because this is pretty big news as far as you know, all the creators on the Capcom side. Let's see what's going to happen. First match of the evening, guys. It's Orange Man versus Crisp coming up. Oh, wow. So, so Orange Man is back. You know, he used to be a Rashid main. We haven't seen much of him this season. I see him on, on net play every now and then. Okay, let's see what he's about, bro. Let us know how the audio is. Yeah, the visualizer says that I'm banned because I had champion Arturo muted. So I'm banned now, chat. It's true. <laughs> but for real, before I get banned, let us know how everything looks and sounds for you guys at home. Let us know, especially if me and Art sound around the same volume level. If not, I can adjust that for you. And uh, let's get into it, guys. First round, who's going to get the first hit of the tournament? Will it be Orange Man or Crisp? Let's see what you guys picked. Oh, Thank okay, you guys for even. getting us basically $200 of the match arena almost. Well, <laughs> yeah, the visualizer the was the one that started it off, bro. He put in like make, make 150 it bucks or something. Yeah, he's, he's, he's about that life. All right, Orange Man and Crisp. Let's go. Good luck to both. Let's party. Round one. All right, who's got to get the first hit? Thank you, Matelko, for the sub. First hit, not decided yet. Oh, it was Orange oh, Man. Oh, Orange Man. That was a crazy first hit. <laughs> crazy first hit. Give him their points. I right, just like Orange Man staying at Old Zeku. He's playing this neutral game. <laughs> the spacing war is paying off for him. Crisp is uh, spending a lot of resources, not really getting anywhere. Puts himself in the corner, but great back throw. Catches him stand crouching on the stand right house to get more pressure. But now, finally, it's Chris' turn. Goes for the reset. Nice. I like the back throw. Gets the positioning. Orange Man knows the challenge after that right house. And it's over. He took really good advantage of that early. Lead. Stayed on him the entire time. Stream, stream, what, what happened in the uh, Sanford versus Punk first to 10? What was the score? <laughs> I don't want to say anything. I just know I saw Sanford afterwards yeah. saying something like every second sucks or something like that. So I don't know. I guess he must have lost. I don't know if that was related or not. I'm just throwing it out there. <laughs> nice. Toss. Okay. Nice grab. Cool. He's using those, those ground kicks well. Another one. Alright, right now, Orange Man, you know, he's sitting in pretty to close it out right here. If he gets any convert, you know, go to the V trigger. Oh, Ooh, nice. We didn't even need it. Did a low, low jab afterwards. 10 7 to Punk. Okay, so okay, that's my man. Close, that's pretty close. Yeah. My man Sanford still got it. He's got to believe in himself. Punk is still a guy that you could say is at major winning level. Like if he enters a major, you could say that he was one. Of the, no matter who's there, he's still one of the favorites to take an entire major. So if you can say you can get seven on him, that ain't too Round bad. One. I'm sure Sanford would be like, that's not good enough though. He wants to win. Yeah, because he feels like it, it's hard to contain people in this game. It is, uh, I mean, I feel them. It is hard to contain people. People get crazy. Plus, everybody knows their frames, so... Also, everybody knows their frames generally, so they kind of don't want to interrupt. So it's hard to get away with stuff. This goes back to that old days versus new days conversation a little bit. In the old days, people... Okay, locked down, because shit is, yeah. shit is bull even more bullshit than it is now. <laughs> Oh, okay. no. Did not have a critical eye yet, so he spent no meter. Wow! 
Wow, he's playing with them. You could have killed him right there. Got the successful shimmy opening, but then didn't take it off the uh, low forward. Round two. Round two now. That's punishable, yes. Nice read. Good punish. Another, Another big punish. Sick. Go combo. Arc Man looking good right now. Activation station. He has to hold the pressure for a little bit. Nice defensive break. Yo, he has the orange suit on. Great button from Crisp at the moment. I like his costume as well. Yeah. Looks sick. Oh no. Oh no. I think he's dead. You see the GG's. Yeah, he's Yeah, you micro walk. <laughs> yeah, well, I forget to get that strong, strong, then you micro walking. <laughs> Hatsugun Rising! Alright. That was sick. That was fun. Orange Man's gonna take the first set. He's gonna start it off with a sweep for you guys at home, everybody. Zeku All you Zeku wins. lovers. It was a sweep, guys. It was a sweep. It was indeed a sweep. <laughs> Thanks for your support, everybody, as always, guys. That was a fun first match. Good start off. Unfortunately, Crisp only got to do so much in that set. But that's how it happened. Sometimes that was a 204 orange mat, yes. Sweep number one of the evening. People are ready for it already. You guys love the sweeps. So, real quick, guys, before we go on to the next match, I want to remind you all, as always, to check out the match in your crowdfund. This is the number one way that you can support the tournament. Thank you, Shaolin Ninja, for putting it in the chat. I was just about to do it myself. Jump in there, check it out, use the codes and goodies, and thank you very much for already $189 of support. Thanks to all of you. Big thanks especially to the homie, the Visualizer, with the big $150 to start us off. Thanks, everyone. All right, guys. Yep, so thank you guys so much. I'm oh, sorry. No, you got art. What were you going to say, bro? Thanks. No, no, I was saying thank, thank you to everybody for taking the time to use the promo codes or sponsor quests. I remember half of your donations do go to Henry Sen to, to, to help him during this pandemic, which is, we don't know when it's going to end. So, you know, your, your support's always appreciated. Absolutely. Thanks, everybody. Quick little look at the bracket, guys, while we set up for the next match. The next one should be, let's see, we did have one lined up. I don't know if the homies will be here. We had Adam R versus the homie Heist. So we'll see if we get that one in here. In the meantime, take a look at what's going on. What's up, bro? Okay, got you. So the homie Heist says he's only been playing the game for a week, guys. So take it easy on him, you know. Oh, yeah. Well, well, wanted to give a shout out to the homie Smoke Monster. You should try that Genesis game that he uh, mentioned. He, he tagged us on Twitter. Yeah, I'm going to take a peek at it. He talked about take a, a peek Genesis at it. Yeah, fighting yeah. game. There was another game I saw recently, too. There's some Genesis... Fan made is not the right word I want to say. It's like an independently made Genesis beat em up. Do you know what I'm talking about? I gotta go. Um, I, I don't really know the cool. name, but like I, I know there's been a lot of indie titles come coming recently. Yeah, but but yeah, but, but yeah, like a. Why not? Basically, if Lord Smoke Monster himself says, says you should try this, it's probably worth looking. At. Yeah, dumb down. Why not? <laughs> In the meantime, guys, let's set up for this next match once again. It's Adam R, and Adam R's opponent is Heist, who says he's new to SFI. Wish him well, everybody. <laughs> oh yeah, it's Paprium, yeah, yeah. Paprium, yeah. That's the game. Okay, yes, that is exactly Yeah, I see that, yeah. Yes. That's the game. It looks dope, honestly. I gotta try it. Alright, how you Oh see? yeah, they're saying I'm a little hot, by the way. Okay. I'll sorry got, what, sorry chat. guys, I'll be I'll be, be trying to be live and direct. We're, we're, we're here virtually, but we're still trying to bring you that same NLBC right. fire. We'll try that. <laughs> let me know if that's better. Yeah, let me know if it's better, guys. Dun, Almost. Dun, dun. Maximum. Thank you. Who was that? Noosh? I definitely heard of. What was that? Yeah, I Shan. We... Yeah, Shan. I'd be hot in here. You know, like we'd be streaming. So, you know, the computers be running hot in the room. I'd be having to turn on the fan. Even in winter. All right. So, next match coming up. Heist, Adam FGC. R is here and Heist is here. Wish them both luck, guys. You guys know the background on the match already. I'm going to set up some basic predictions for you in just a moment choose your favorites everybody from he says take it easy on me like yeah, yo you know what that means that's a nah man <laughs> nah don't fall Come for on, his bro. he's been playing for the game for a week he says okay he what says if it's a troll what, yeah he says, he says. He says. He yeah says. right <laughs> let's do this <laughs> 
He even gave himself a crazy sponsor tag or whatever. It's an OS. Yeah, it's going to be some crazy. Oh, watch him be like somebody OD. <laughs> thank you. Thank you, wow, uh, Fresh, thank you, fresh Slice, Slice Leeches. Leeches. Wow. That was Damn, so many gifts. How many up. was that? Ten. 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 Thank you, Fresh Slice Leeches. Guys, if you guys got a free gift sub just now, you got to thank the homie. We're hooking you up so you can get those free icons and goodies and everything else. Thank you, Fresh Slice Leeches. Stick around, my friend. Enjoy some great matches right now. We got Adam R, Adam R versus Heist. Not Helst. The Tekken Monster Heist. Yeah, Heist. That, that's what I thought it was at first. Don't worry. I'll let you Thank you. He also hooked us up with mad bits. Thanks, bro. Thank you. Thank you, you for giving me a birthday on you, my yeah, friend. Bits. Hell yeah. Alright, Adam R. Right now, you he's in the whole tech. He has a lot of experience in this tournament. I don't know. Nice. Was, was he telling the truth? He's struggling in the corner right now. Let's see what happens. Can he get out? Everybody struggles, everybody struggles when they're forced to block in this game, those folks. I gotta see okay. what happens when he's on the offense. Okay. Oh, he got, okay. He got, he's I not see. a perfect. It's not a perfect. That's something. <laughs> yeah, he, he, yeah, he was a little bit green there on the offense because you know he went for an ex shoulder after the back throw. Okay. Instead of safe pressure. Let's see what happens. Oh, there's Smoke Monster in the chat. What's good, Smoke Monster? Yeah, he was in the chat. That's what I was oh, saying. The whole time. Yeah. Okay. That's all. Yeah, Bro, the whole time. Yeah. Just so you know, at home chat. Sometimes yeah. when I do this, I'm doing like five things yeah. at once, so I can't even read what's going on. Yeah, exactly. I understand. Yes, Mogul. I'm just here on the mic chilling. I'm not streaming. You know, Vic's doing all the back end stuff, so sometimes you forget. Check the chat. Ouch. Taking the bets. Doing all the back end nice stuff. Thing. Nice. Nice some Adam R. Good roundhouse. Okay. That's going to be it. Yeah, game over. Mostly Yuri 101 here. Nice link. That was cool. Yeah, uh, yeah. Stuff I mean, you when, you, when you land the X Vitalik Spear like that, you know, you, you can charge Yuri the second you um, fireball comes out. So you get a nice flashy headbutt at the end. I don't even have any good tips for Heist because it's Yuri. Don't get cornered, I guess. <laughs> it's not really much of a tip for him. Focus on we'll cross-ups against Yuri. I mean, like, Yuri's cross-ups give him a lot of trouble. Laura has a command grab, too. You know, you can definitely make it uncomfortable for him. All right, game number two. He, he, yeah, he's looking a little bit Apparently. hesitant. Didn't check that headbutt when it whiffed. Ouch. To be fair, a lot of people don't really check that headbutt. Like, I don't check it either. It comes out too fast. But uh, Adam too. M. Adam is, is definitely in control. He gets the he gets the optimal new draw spacing, so he's advantage. Yeah, he's kind of just he's kind of just letting Heist so kind of hang himself. Though. Heist has trigger though, so he uh, he doesn't know how to use it yet. Oh, he no, missed the punish opportunity. Yeah, he's getting away with sweeps. Oh man! If he okay, knew what he was so, doing, he could have wrecked him for that. Unfortunately. Yes. Yeah, so it looks like it was true. He was a little bit green. Because he started yeah. spamming sweeps and like he didn't do anything. Yeah, he's doing it again. He's taking yeah. advantage of his lack of knowledge. That's a punish. It's unfortunate. I'm sorry. Sorry, Heist. I mean, this is a tournament. You know, there's yeah. no rule oh, that I says you have to take it easy on the other guy. You don't. It's, it's, oh, he didn't even kill him. <laughs> he's just, he's he's just nice. trying to mess with them. I mean, he's he's nice he seems to troll. be able to tell that he doesn't know what's going on, right? So he's being nice and, you know. Hit him with the oh, bodega tactics, overhead or low. <laughs> oh my goodness, I'm sorry, guys. Don't, don't apologize. Don't apologize. That was You're a learning experience win. for the homie. Yeah, Heist. definitely. He got too old. It's all right, Heist. It's not over for you, my friend. I know it was a sweep, but please try your luck in the loser side of the bracket. Hey, sometimes you just got experiences. Sometimes you're just like, I want to see what Street Fighter is about. Let me see what it's about. Oh. I got my ass kicked. That's what it was about. Yeah, that, and yeah, th true. Thank you, the homie was also for, uh, yeah, was also the tournament, <laughs> but he, he's still in the he's still in the losers bracket, guys. It maybe maybe it would have gone a little easier for him if he had fought another character that wasn't Yuri. To be fair, but yeah, props heist I'm, for answering my friend. It's not over for you. Try your luck on the losers side. Yeah, this tournament is like this tournament is full of the top of the tops, guys. So we <laughs> do appreciate like anybody that's you know trying to get the Street Fighter to entering. Yep. But, you know, unfortunately, so, it's yeah. very tough. Yes, yeah, so usually tournament. the first time that you enter this type of tournament, 0-2 is, is kind of what you're predicted to get. If you go 1-2, you're like, yeah, I beat one guy in losers before I got bodied or something like that. That's about as good as you can expect your first tournament at one of these. Unless you just really know what you're doing off the bat. It ain't easy. These guys are good as hell. We got more matches coming up for all of you at home, fellas. A quick little look at the bracket to give you an idea of where everything stands. Let's see where we're at. A lot of matches going on in round two. Profit made it to round three over Lord Adam. Oh, yeah. Looks like I have to play a match, so I will be back, Spooky. Okay, bro. Check out my viewpoint, Twitch.tv, NYC Furby. Check them out, guys. Check out the squad stream also. You got the squad running. 
Yeah. That's fine. Yeah, check out the squad stream, guys. You can jump in that way as well, fellas. Watch his viewpoint. Many of the other players like to stream themselves here on Twitch during the event. I've mentioned this before. You can check out the Street Fighter V category here on Twitch. Look for all the homies with NLPC in their title. And all you players that are streaming yourselves, don't forget to tweet us uh, at Team Spooky. Use that hashtag NLPC so that we know to retweet you and let the people know to watch you at home and what you're doing. In the meantime, I'm pretty sure this is OG Yawn because only OG Yawn would use a crazy name like this versus Ludovic. So we're going to line it up for you guys, fellas. Ludovic. Oh, okay. Well, that's sad, but, you know, sometimes that's what happens. So Maryland versus Maryland, it looks like. This is round two of the bracket, guys. They're both representing the THG crew. Let's do this. Oh, uh, by the way, uh, I should kind of plant seeds about this now, whether or not we do it. So, do, do you still do you still want me to tell the guys about resetting the seeds next week? Uh, I'll, I'll think about it. Okay. Anyway, we're strongly considering resetting seeds for you guys starting next week. Uh, we'll give you a final answer on that probably later today if it happens. Mostly because we're in like week forty something of the online, and there's some different guys here. Oh, nah, Heist, honestly, he, if anything, at the end of the match, Heist, he was, like, he knew he, he knew that you couldn't tell what was going on, so he somewhat took it easy on you. He basically was like, I'm just going to do overhead and low over and over and see if you can deal with it. So he was being nice. If you had blocked any of those sweeps and done a real combo, you could have hurt him a lot for those. So that was Tim. I, th I mean, yeah, he's trolling a little bit, but it was more like him being nice. Listen, my Kung Fu. I'll show you. Anyway, the winner of that one was Adam, guys. We got another nice one coming up. This one is Ludovic. Hello. That's how you start the fight and finish it quickly. Round Vic one. Versus the homie OG Yon. This should be a good one, guys. Yo, good heist. You had a couple moments there where you could have done something good. You blocked his sweep and then you did what was that standing medium kick or whatever. If you had V trigger canceled that standing medium kick and done a whole combo, you could have hurt him a lot in that one moment. There's a couple spots there where you had some opportunities. Ah, what's up, Adnan? Thanks for the 25, bro. Hold up to the homie Lord Adnan, who's also here in the tournament tonight. Wish him luck, everyone. Nice block. Okay, Ludovic, round one, commanding. Don't hold a grudge, okay? Round two. Star Gladiator. I just noticed she has like a heart on the leggings. That's cool. Nice short. Nice cross under also. Damn, Ludovic is on fire. He has been very strong at this series lately. You guys already know. Consistent, I want to say consistent top five, right? Almost every week. Top eight, top five. Put himself in the money at quite a few of these. Oh, only, only, you don't see too much of this character also in Chun. Let me think about the big Chuns we see. We have the homie Terrence. He's really sick. We have Ludovic. We have Rob. That plays a Chun sometimes, right? Nice. Sick and an overhead to finish it out. Ludovic, game number one. Chun Li wins. We'll see how Yon answers back. Oh yeah, unsymmetrical. Also, Ludovic is, this guy is not like a regular Chun. This guy's definitely exceptional, right? So go he's going to make any, chun, he's going to make any like Luke Chun or anybody that's just starting out. You're definitely going to feel not as fast as he is. He definitely makes her look quick fast. 1-0 right now for Ludovic, guys. The set is not over. Thank you for your support, by the way. There was quite a few guys that have been supporting us. Thanks for all the subs. First off, there was Adnan. Thank you, Adnan. Fresh Slice Leeches with the big 10 gift subs. Nushi. Thank you, Nushi, for the 98. Briven. Thank you, Briven, for your 11. Super Unknown 89. Motoko. Thank you, Motoko. C Gray 333. Little Emo Forever. Padamon. Rob Star. 10 of Clubs. Thank you all for your subscriptions and support, guys, the bits, and all the goodies that you guys have given so far. 
There was also a lot of matchmaker you know, contributors. Thank you, Queen Julia, for your big ten dollars. Thank you, Ten of Clubs. Thank you, Jungle Jake, for your big four dollars. Vincentius One NG with the big five as well. And to everybody that's been using the code, there's been a lot of you. Let's Round go. One. Fight. All right, so game number two coming up. There was one at the start of this one, Savage. It was basically a who do you think will win bet. Now we're in game number two. Oh, good, Savage. You only get like a minute or something to put those in, right? So if you don't catch, you gotta wait till the next one. We'll see if the outfit changed. Help the homie going out. Here. Does anybody else think she says panda when she gets up? The tech girl panda. Ouch. He didn't even cancel the trigger right now. Oh, he's never mind. Yon's the one that has the trigger. Here it is. No, we're out of there. We don't take this. Clap. No. Pretty good fireballs by Ludovic. Round two. He saw the plan right. of the lightning shields, but I'm faster. Does anybody remember the beta when Chumley could throw multiple fireballs and V-Trigger? Anybody remember that? No. Damn, he almost got that. Nice block. Woo, wow. That was dangerous. Little Vic, you have some godlike footsies, man. I don't know what's going on over there. What's in the water in Maryland? Damn. That was godlike. All right. I'm sorry, y'all. It seems like the night of a thousand sweeps is most definitely back in 2021. Ludovic's gonna take that one clean. Chun Li wins. <laughs> I mean, they know each other. I guess this ain't so bad. I don't use this stuff enough. I need to use it more. It's fun. <laughs> Sweet number three Get of the night, time. guys. Damn, Lord R has been put to work already. I'm gonna pay out your predictions, everybody, and we're gonna set up the next match. Seems like you guys had Ludovic as a pretty strong favorite there, but don't give up on the homie Yon, okay? He's had some strong performances at NOBC before, and uh, we'll see what he can do on the loser's side of the bracket tonight. Meantime, let's take a peek at that bracket. I want to see what's going on. Where are we at? Let's see. All right, so Just a Kid, a.k.a. Just a Son, made it to round number three. Thanks for the hookup. Thank you. Thanks for the host. I appreciate that, my friend. Was that the homie Cozy Phil? Thanks, brother. We got Joey versus Prophet. Is that going to be on stream? Dancelip versus Shine. Pink versus Mr. Dark Ice. And right now, we got Space Boy versus Old Crippler. Looks like Old Crippler is going to be on the player one side, guys. Let me get that ready for all of you. Is he like Organ Crippler? Old Crippler? <laughs> Why did I think of that? I forgot what that's even from. This is Space Boy FGC. I'm gonna move out of the way so they can get started in just a moment. We'll put in some predictions for you guys in just a moment as well. Good luck, everybody. So, player one side, like I said, it's Old Crippler. Let's do this. Player two side is Space Boy. Neither one is representing a sponsor or anything like that. They're just going to grind it on and show you what they can do. You guys probably most know the homie Space Boy. He's competing here quite a lot. He's very strong with his Sakura. And he has a couple other characters that he's been working on as well. But you know how it is. Sometimes you associate a player with a character. And Space Boy is certainly one that a lot of you will associate with Sakura play. Cody versus Sakura. We don't see this that often. Desk work just...
Round one. Fight. This is still round two of the bracket. The winner of this has to fight the winner of Lord Art and Ramsey. Art won that one. Okay, so, so Art is going to be facing the winner of this match. Nope. We don't like the man grabs. Wow. Quick fast start for Lord Space Boy. Round two. Fight. Bro, he has on the greenest of suits tonight. Leaf green. Wait for an uppercut or something like that, but Space Boy did not fight. <laughs> oh yeah. <laughs> I just saw that exchange in the chat with AA Shen. <laughs> you guys are the best. Space Boy takes game number one. Wash your hands. What's good? What's good, Art? No, I don't want to I want to see the rest of that. <laughs> all right, game Round number two. All right, cool. So, all right, we just... Catch up. Yeah, so the first match, just so you know, Space Boy took it, Lord. All right, so it's 1-0 between Space Boy yeah, no. and Old Crippler. Yeah, okay, so I got to fight the winner of this, so I, my eyes are open. Yeah, yeah, you're invested, bro. What's, it's going to be either Sakura or Cody, although it's looking very good for Space Boy, based on how the first game went. I mean, like, I feel like I feel like against Cody, he might lose in neutral, but then you know the, the end game, the end game mix kind of makes up for it. And he has two bar triggers, so it's easy for him to get that robbery. Let's see what happens in the later stages of the game. He's been trying to rob with the command grab, but Space Boy has been very good about avoiding it so far. All right, well, oh, never mind. He did not take any, no pressure at all. Plus frames, no problem. Press the button. And we get that EX fireball to win. Traded. Round two. Thank you, the Toll War. Yeah, the, the Toll War. Thank you. Thank you so much. Appreciate the support, my friend. Ooh, wow. Nice jump. He predicted that he would fireball back. Almost got the stun. That is a stun on the throw page. Not that, but it's going to be close. It's going to be a lot of damage. That's extension. Whoa, oh, my dead. Wow. God. Okay. Monster damage right there. Good stuff sweep. For Sakura, it's a win. sweep. The night of a thousand sweeps is back. <laughs> oh, what is going on? Number four of the evening. Was that every match? Was just a sweep? We can't have a close yeah, match. Yeah, it's, it's just a speed run. <laughs> all it right. Is, it, it is speed run week after all on Twitch. I guess so. Yeah. <laughs> or some kind of GDQ is going on. I don't even know which yeah. one it is. They have a GDQ. That's what matters. They do games quick on those. It's in the name. <laughs> Damn. So, guys, Narrator. First of all, let me hook up the homie Narrator. Narrator1, I see you, my friend. He says he wants a shout out. Sure, homie. We appreciate you, brother. Thanks, Narrator. I hope that you're having a good year so far, brother. Thanks for using all those soul coins. You could have saved them all for bets, but instead you wanted to hear from us. Thank you, brother. Appreciate your support. Thank you very much. Very kind of you, brother. Damn, people be saving up the points just for us to say hello. Thanks, narrator. Andre Gio, thanks, my friend. Yeah, thank you, you for the, the sweep. Oh, you resold for the sweep. Okay, cool. Glad you enjoyed it, bro. We should have up like crazy tonight. Yep. I yes, do sir. appreciate your support, guys. Spooky, One more time, spooky, check spooky, out that Match Me No Crowdfund if you have just a moment. Especially use the codes and the goodies that you can find in the sidebar from our special sponsors. Thanks to you, we're already over $200, which is freaking awesome, guys, because we haven't even reached the third round of the tournament just yet. Thanks to our friends at Rig Gaming, G Fuel. We love you, G Fuel. We love you, Rig Gaming. Thanks to our friends in the FGC as well that you can check out all for free in these Twitter quests, YouTube quests, and other goodies. Last but not least, a big thank you to our top contributors, including the Visualizer, starting us off with a big 150, Queen Julia, Vincentius, Jungle Japes, and Ten of Clubs. Thank you all very much. Now we got the next match, guys. Looks like Rob TV is stepping up to the plate. Hollywood Rob TV, let's go. That's right. 
and Rob's up again. I'm taking a look in the bracket right now. Oh, looks like I have to go. I have to play Spaceboy right now. So All right, brother. Yeah, good luck to you, my friend. Lord R versus Spaceboy coming up. We're just waiting for uh, the homie Rob's opponent. Bro, I'm blind today. I can't even see where Rob's name is in the bracket. There's so many matches here. Check out the homie Rob TV here on Twitch also. He streams himself all the time. He streams quite often. He's been on that content creator life. I understand. I live that life. Thank you for your support and subscriptions also, everybody. Thanks to you, Team Spooky is strong. Would you guys like to see the power of the Skull Army? Nah, let me stop. Thanks for, a lot for the support, though, guys. Thanks to you. We're very close to getting back to 1,400 subscribers here on Twitch. And it's definitely helping us. It's definitely helping us. All right, Metro M versus Rob TV coming up, everybody. It looks like Rob is here, and it looks like Metro M is here. So let's get this in there for you. We'll also set up a nice prediction for you in just a moment. Good luck to both monsters today. Thank you, Syntax Incorporated, for using your Prime, my friend, and supporting us. Thank you, Syntax. I appreciate you, brother. We're going to jump into the next match in just a moment, guys. Stick around if you want to see it. Looks like the players are about ready. Let's set up a skull prediction for all of you at home. The winner of the last match, everybody, was Space Boy. He was a 97% favorite. I guess that's not a surprise. You guys love him. Coming up, it's match number five. Oh, we started a hype train. Woo! Thanks, everybody. I appreciate you guys. Now's a great time to donate and support if you've been on the fence and holding out. Use that Prime. Get the goodies. NS.hack. Thank you, NS.hack, for your Prime. We appreciate it. Right behind the homie Syntax. Thank you both for your support. Thank you, EMP Tuggles McMuscle Buns. What a name. For some reason, that makes me think of, like, H and K. I don't know why, though. <laughs> I don't know why. It's just, just weird. All right. Anyway, Rob TV player one, Metro M is player two, guys. I believe you guys have a prediction in there. That you can jump on for and choose your favorite. I'm just going to double check and see which round this is. This is round three. So, round three officially underway, everybody. Slice. Yeah, you know, Rob TV has multiple characters that he can choose. So if he chooses Chun here, uh, then I'm confident that, at least in his mind, he thinks that this is a, a not bad matchup for Chun or a good matchup for Chun. Wow! Actually denied the V reversal, but did not get. Did not get a combo. No. Metro up's gonna take round number one. Clean fast. Round two. Fight. Yeah, so what's up with that? Have a Melodic Master points this out too. A lot of the players are converting to PC. Is that what's happening? Everybody was on PS4 forever. And they're all switching now because there's no PS4 tournaments anymore. <laughs> Except for Capcom Cup, I guess. That's the official. I guess that makes sense. PC version is better. I mean, that's what it comes down to. It just comes down to architecture, right? Of course, the PC is going to be a better version than a console version. No, miss again. That was weird. Pretty sure he wanted that to be a combo, right? He's gonna try another character. He's definitely not gonna let that rock. That was too crazy. Metro M. Meanwhile, Metro's like, yo, have you seen my tattoo? <laughs> I'm a snake. Uh, yeah, so Saved by Instinct Punk is indeed playing tonight. What's up, Kaiba? Also, I see you. Round one. Well, he's trying it again. He wants to give it give it a try. I'm surprised that he didn't pick like Gal or something. Like, wouldn't Gal be nice? It just throw Sonic Booms. Down back forever. Maybe I'm wrong. I don't know. Oh, is that what it is? He has a god like jump in against that type of tactic. Us. Thank you, VG Hero. Oh my god, was that 20? Holy crap. VG Hero, you are my hero. 
to say the least. Holy crap. Thank you for the 20, my friend, of support. You guys also make sure to thank him, everyone, if you received a little something from Lord PG Hero. Damn, he's up to 340 gift subscribers. That's crazy. You've given me a lot of money, my friend. And Metro, with the clean bait on the wake of Spinning Bird there. See, but in the canon, he's in the canon. Metro's supposed to lose this. This is not looking good. I feel like last time we saw this. <laughs> Metro got super to death by what's that Ludovic? Crush. He backdashed again. He doesn't care. He just got crush countered for that. Oh my god. Metro. Okay. Activate, yep. He has to do another one. Took the mask. Got it. Ooh, on the dot. Just enough damage. Final round. Final round game two. I don't know what's about to happen. Vetra has been actually looking excellent. This almost looked like another sweep. The curse is strong. Rob is the one that had to. Oh, the curse is really strong. This is a lot of damage. He lost about 35% at the start. Anti air with the short. Man, the flips are actually kind of putting in some okay work for Metro. Woo! He got a full combo for that. Command grab. That was a little risky on the viewers. It did work out. And Rob. Okay, Rob's still on his feet. Sick. That was a punish. Excellent. Rob. Oh, it crossed up. Oh my god, he got a whole combo for that. Nice break. Still oh, that was crazy. <laughs> Vega wins. It would have just gone through her or something weird, right? Yeah. Damn. All right. The curse is strong. I don't know what to say. That curse is powerful. I'm sorry, y'all. Rob TV is headed to the loser side of the bracket. Retro M. He was stabbing up, and then he got that one little that one little corner situation that he needed to help him close it out. <laughs> I agree, AA Shen. We watched it actually not too long ago, thanks to you know how you can watch movies on Twitch through Amazon Prime. And the, the chat also loved it, of course. Who wouldn't love that fight? That's a very good, one of the best. Well, I'm sorry, guys. Rob TV, one of your favorites, is in the loser's bracket. But, guys, it's not over for him. Worry not. So, even if you're disappointed a little bit, he still has a chance to come back from the loser's side of the bracket. In the meantime, I'm going to show you a look at what we can expect because we still have a lot of great matches coming up. Let's take a look and see what's going on in round three right now. Okay, Idom is already in round four, in fact. Art's playing against Spaceboard. The winner of that gets a nice present. They gotta fight Idom. Not a good present at all, but anyway. Smug versus Ludovic. The winner fights Prophet. That's another good one. Zaffarino versus Fluxwaves. The winner fights Shine. Man, these, these quarterfinals matches are gonna be sick. You guys are gonna love them. Now, we got another great one for you guys. I hope that you guys will love it. It's Brian F. Cheer for him, everybody, because he's up against one of the gods. It's Punk. Pink. I'm sorry. He's pink now. He's not, he's not punk. I lied to y'all. Let me move out of the way, guys. We're going to set up your predictions in just a moment. This is round number three. Team Equinox versus the Lords at Panda Global. Good luck to both. Don't forget about that curse, everybody. It's strong. <laughs> Whoever takes the first game. Let's do it, guys. Choose your favorite. Yeah, so Savage uh, Punk, as you might know him as, has been going by a few different names lately. He goes sometimes by Pink, and sometimes he goes by P-Unk. He also likes to rock the pink cotton when he rocks his name. We'll see if he chooses to do that here. Oh, he's he's got the pink Colleen. All right. <laughs> Yo, is he is he Nurse Colleen right now? <laughs> Round one. <laughs> Fight. I'm done. Okay. Pretty good start for Brian F. Punk defending himself from the corner. Nice crush knockdown. Into the throw. 
No, check, check. Nice up back. Brian has uh, the smallest of leaks. It can evaporate quickly thanks to this V trick. There it is. This is big down. Now we get the corner. Time for a setup. Oh, man. He's not even playing Colleen right now. Is he playing Cotton? <laughs> he did stand jab, walk back. Got it to work perfectly. Okay. Crush. Damn. Punk is strong, chat. What can I tell you? Trades. Who's a lore master in the chat? I want to know what is Colleen's fighting style? What's that? Lin Kuei? <laughs> like Mortal Kombat. <laughs> Sistema? What the hell does that mean? Is she a robot? Oh, it's a Russian martial art. Okay, I see. Just have a lot of throws. I can see how you compare it to like a Sambo style or something like that. Pink takes key number one, pretty convincingly here. The toughest part for Brian with this is that Pink has the ability to come at him with so many different matchups that even if he figures out this Colleen matchup, whatever character uh, Pink chooses next might be equally dangerous. All right, we'll see what Lord Brain F has for him. I'm gonna move out of the way to make it quicker for them. He does have G as an option, which would not be bad here, I guess. He has others too, but I think the most likely if he was going to switch, he would probably switch to G, right? He is today. I don't know if he's here permanently or if he's just chilling for a little bit or whatever, but he's, you know, he does have the opportunity to answer the tournament, and we're definitely fortunate to have him here. Oh, he did. He's moved, so it's a permanent move. Okay, or at least for a little while or something. Okay. Well, you know, let's be happy to have him here to give us some practice. Hopefully, he can help us get to his level, get on his level. Much like Laura Idom, who enters every week. The sides are flipped now, everybody. So keep that in mind. A uh, pink is now on the player one, and Brian is player two. Round one. Oh uh, yeah, Shen. So we allow Montreal and Toronto area to enter because uh, East Coast Canada they actually have some good Street Fighter monsters, and they're actually in enough of a range that the connections are not too bad. So we do allow some Canada to play. We got some good ones that enter from that Montreal area too. Double. Okay. Nice neutral job. Okay, back to the mid screen. So Brian's gonna have to put in a lot of work to get that corner. Ooh, got a range. It's so hard to react to that in time. If you react fast enough to that, you get a down jab there. That's good for you, right? But then when you don't react in time, they kind of keep their turn even though they whip the throw. That's always tough. Why is her V-Trigger two bars? Why is this character so underrated? That's what I would say, Notebook, right? She has a one-frame counter. People don't pick this character. I don't understand. It doesn't make any sense. Probably one of the most underrated characters in the entire game. Cool. Round two. Nice rush. Okay. There you go, Brian. Nice back dash. Damn, Punk, amazing defense in that situation. If he had gotten hit there, that was a guaranteed stun. Now he can survive. He does not have very much help to work with, but he does have his speed to... Whoa, he slid that far. Sure, but that's like when you tell me Leo is top tier in Tekken, right? And then you just don't find guys picking Leo. I feel like that with this character, Colleen. Excellent finish by Brian. Character's obviously excellent, but nobody picks him. Fight. 
triple dash. Bro, he's, he's, he's landing those roundhouses perfectly. Even when they're not crush counters, he's threading Brian's buttons. That ain't easy to do. It's not like Brian has not been using the stand HP like that right there. Really good long range. Excellent shutdown. Okay, Brian. Ooh. That was frightening. I didn't know if he was going to be able to do something or not. He might have been able to do the X counter. Break. Okay. Yeah, Clamper, I was thinking the same thing, right? He had enough time to EX counter there and get a nice hit. But, either way, we're back to the neutral. Punk is holding on to the tiniest of beats. The throw helps. EX. Nice. Okay, excellent check. A little shimmy there. Really dangerous footsies there from Punk. But, Brian, nice. Down jab. No, stay on the floor, home bro. There you go. One more mix. Ooh, he was out of reach. Did she get two V-Triggers in one round? Ooh. Thank God he shut that down with DX Rush. And the sweep was finally denied, everybody. Finally. It's a real match. One to one between Brian and Pink. Damn, he got two V-Triggers in one round. It's a good thing that he it's a good thing for Brian that Pink got hit raw there by the EX because if he had blocked and still could play with the V-Trigger, that would have been a very dangerous round. Game number three coming up. It does not look like Pink has chosen to switch characters. It looks like he's going to stick to the Colleen plan here. Okay. So apparently, guys, just let you know at home, it sounds like we're going to get Arturo versus Lord Idom shortly on stream down the quarterfinals match. What's up, Bart? We're just yeah. waiting for this next match to start up. Something happened. Oh yeah, I think I'm ahead of you now when I joined. So I saw on Discord. By the time okay. my match Are started. You, wait, can you can you see a match? Because we see nothing. Yeah, We're yeah. like stuck. I'm in, in a match. match. You want me to um yeah here, yeah, I'll feature my Discord screen. Oh, uh, I guess I don't know. Yeah, I think I guess. we're stuck. I think they're playing and we're stuck. You let they us. They are know playing. I'm watching it. I'm watching it. Oh wait, there we go. Did it kick us out to the lobby? What did it even do? I'm so confused. Check my uh, check my Discord. Oh, they kicked us out. No, yeah. no, we all got kicked yeah. out. That no, you were watching the end of the last match. That's what it was. That made total sense. I was like, what? That can't be. That's impossible. There's no way you're watching a match like that. Oh, yeah, he understood. knows. He's yeah. Cool. All right, let's try that again. Right, so I can kill my Discord feed. Then. No, no, no. That was that was something was like wrong. Are they really playing Space Boy? No, they're not. No, they're not. Right? They're not. They're not, they're not. <laughs> I, I'm, I was. Seeing I mean, I'm taking a Space Boy's word for it because he can see the streams too, right? So he might have just saw, I don't know, one of their streams and saw them playing or something. That's why. Yeah, and, and then the the spectator mode it just feeds us their input. So sometimes yeah. I'm seeing shit that already happened. That happened already. I know it's weird like that. All right. Yeah. Well, hopefully that was just a minor CFN thing. No big deal. And now we're jumping into game number three. It's a Pink versus Brian. Actually, Brian is on the player one, everybody, and Pink is player two. Uh oh. The alpha round one. entering consistent now. Fight. Yeah, he's, he's he's entering consistent now. Stream. We gotta get on this level, bro. We're gonna be a lot. Yeah, of we, we we gotta step it up. He's bringing rush punch for Brian F. It's also good to see Brian F again. I haven't seen him here in a couple of weeks. It's been a bit actually since he's been here. So far, he has tied it up against the Colleen. Nice, nice shimmy. The stand job was good. Good break. Oh, <laughs> it's a two-part sweep. <laughs> yeah, it is. <laughs> Hold the trigger pressure. Brian not view reversaling. That plus one situation traded for him, but he view reversal the second time on the field. Goes to show like uh, how good that button is when you want to view reversal a negative three move. In the fierce. You see right there, that's why. It's a godlike whiff punish. Of course you want to view reversal and knock it down. I understand, but kill the uh, comeback factor for him. Oh no, no oh, check no. on the counter. No check on the counter. He gets punished instead for dashing. Yeah. Oh. oh, you reach, I teach. Only one of the best is shimmying. 
and now he's in a bad situation. Damn, freeze! In a really bad situation. Punk playing OD. Finally gets out of the freeze. Get nice walk back. Punk. That was godlike. Godlike play. Okay. Finally, combo. Ryan gets to no. play. No, he doesn't. He didn't get to play. Did not get to play in game number three, and Pink is going to take it, everybody, oh, two to one. Win. Brian Neff is going to have to try his luck on the loser side of the bracket. At least it wasn't a sweep. I don't know what to say. He's strong, guys. It's go time. <laughs> only monsters in this tournament. I, I, I agree. It is really only monsters. You're right about that. Mm -hmm. So you got to play Art now, I think it sounds like, right against Idom. Good luck to you, my friend. All right. Peace. Do your best, brother. Stick around. Guys, if you want to see more matches, we got some more great action coming up for you. A pink was the winner of the last match, 2-1 to one, over Lord Brian F. But it's not over for him just yet. Guys, make sure to cheer him on. Check him out here on Twitch as well. And give him a follow, too, if you love his great gameplay. I love watching him play. That's for sure. Bracket-wise, fellas, we're winding down to the winner's top eight. We got some great quarterfinals matches coming up for all of you. Idom versus Lord Art. We're going to see that momentarily here on stream. We have Prophet versus Ludovic. Shine versus Flux Waves. Let's go Canada. And Metro M versus Pink. Let's also go New York. Let's go. I'm going to move to the back while this match gets started, guys. In the meantime, I want to thank you all for your big match arena support. If you haven't had a chance yet, fellas, and you're just joining us tonight on stream, please jump in there and help us out on the match arena crowdfund. As always, we appreciate your support. You can use that coupon code SAVENOBC152 to add 50 cents absolutely free to support the top three players tonight. And again, if we reach a $750 prize pool in the match arena, it will be a top five payout, which means that the players eliminated in fifth place will still get a little something from all of you at home. Winner's quarterfinals is about to begin, everybody. Lord Saban, player one side. Lord Idom on the player two. Two of the best in the biz guys. Idom has a numerous titles here at this one. But Art has definitely taken it before. Match number seven is about to begin. Choose your favorites. Dun, 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 dun. Thanks for the support, guys. Was there anybody else that wanted a shout out? We got the homie Pai Mei, we got the homie Dandrick, Nost, Monkey Meatloaf, and Round Narrator one. 1. Once again, thanks Narrator Fight. 1 for your support. You guys are the best. All right, Lord Art is on the player one, everyone at home. Idom, the god, is on player two. He's rocking the special outfits today, Lord Idom. Only he can wear those. Can't buy it. Thank you, Midget on Steroids, for the six eons of support. What a name. <laughs> thank you, bro. Thank you also, Mizi L. Sanit. He says, I just sucked. Well, thank you, Mizi. I appreciate the support, brother. Thanks for representing the skull. Very kind. Thank you. Thank you. All right. Round Lord Art two. took round number one. Fight. Yo, are oh, you just waiting? Duff. I don't answer back so quick this round that I don't even know what to say for that. Oh my god, it's like 20 percent of his life. That was like a 80% life sequence or something? What happened to all of his life bar? I thought we were playing Street Fighter. <laughs> and Ida's relentless. He's trying to finish the job. No comebacks. Final round. Fight. <laughs> that was crazy. All right. Thank you, Gem, for the bits, my friend. Welcome to the stream, Lord Gem. I hope that you're doing well today, brother. You've probably been here the whole time. Elbows, links. Why does she get links after that? Oh my god. Reverse. Mercy, please. Yes, let me out. Damn. He jabbed there and it got a counter hit? 
His jab really is two frames. No, he wanted to teleport. Nice punish. We'll take it. Teleport picks. Waiting for the reversal. That was a good fear steer. He kind of set up a nice situation, but he ended chose to back out shimmy style. No. Oh, it's still there. Wow, okay. That could have been worse. See, like, I knew that would happen like that. No, he missed. It. Oh, we'll take it. He didn't have meter. Damn, meter would have been so sick there. Nice throw. Bro, this is really not over. Mini slot into flame. Now he has a meter, but he can't he can't take anything. A random hit or something is gonna take all that gray. You gotta be young art. No gray. Yes, no gray. Young art. Woo! Let's go! Yes! 1-0. Let's go. Dalton win. <laughs> that was sick. All right. Round one. That was both selfie young art. Right. We'll see how Ida matches the game too. He's he's he, Ida's trying to play a whole different game. He's like, let me see if I can whip punish some buttons or something. Totally different game from how he tried to play it in game number one. This is winners, will tie. Winners quarters, my friend. Winners quarter final. The winner of this is guaranteed top eight, no matter what. Guys, if you're enjoying the amazing play, as always, support the match, Torino. You're not gonna see. Ooh, he did it too fast, and I got out. That was extremely fortunate. He fell on it. Free mix, all the mix, all the chip. Damn, that was sick. That was dumb. All right, Art. Round two. Ida's plan is most definitely still to try to whip punish buttons. So far, Art has not fallen for it. He's not giving any free buttons away. Good thunder. Good jab. His boxing are sick. He's got Ida just rushing up and trying to get close. Excellent. Excellent spacing and a good throw. Pressure with the slides again. No, he's getting aggressive and it's not working. Free Oh, he could have gotten more. Finally, Idom gets in. Let's see what he can do with the activation time. Oh yeah, it's party time. It's my time. Nice job. Come on, Art. A little more. He does have a V trigger. He activates immediately. If he can set this off, yes. Oh yeah. Good block. No. Slip it, slip it. Slide. Still not enough. I don't try to come back with no help. No, he felt. What even hit him? Something hit him. Was it the up flame? Did he do an up flame or something like that? I don't even know what he traded with. Good Dolphin shit, Art. Win. What move did he even do? Was that an up flame? That was sick. Up fire? Okay, cool. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Cool. That was godlike. Good shit. 2 0. The curse of a thousand sweeps working out for Lord Arturo. That was extremely impressive. I gotta say, that was a lot of fun. It almost felt like Idom didn't really get to play for some of those rounds. Yeah. Yeah. That's right. <laughs> that was <Oof>. sick. <laughs> that was sick, Art. Good shit, bro. That was a lot of fun to watch, man. So all respect to Lord Idom, guys. He's actually sent to the loser's bracket. Not the first time, fellas. Trust me. He can definitely come back from this positioning. But it is a disadvantage in that even if he makes it all the way to the grand finals, he'll have to win two sets of three out of five. So a long tour order for him. And a good shit, Art. You did it, bro. You made it into the winner's side. Props. Yeah, tournament's still not over yet, though. So it's like, no, let's stay focused. So, fellas, if you guys enjoyed that once again, I implore you to please support that match with crowdfund. We've got another great match coming up for all of you in just a second. It's going to be the homie Flux Waves versus Shine. It's another great match, guys. We're going to put in your predictions in just a moment. Please support that match if you're enjoying yourselves, fellas. Shine, representing Team Endemic. Flux Waves, representing the OCG crew. Good luck to both monsters. Let's do it, guys. There are a lot of you that I would like to thank on the match we know momentarily. Let me just get a prediction in for you guys first, because I know you guys love those. Damn. Wait, what? <laughs> it almost had like a... Damn, that was a 92% favorite. That's crazy. All right. 
match number eight coming up, guys. Once again, it's Flux Ways Player One, Shine is Player Two. Round one. Fight. And a big thank you to some of the recent match, you know, contributors and supporters, guys. Thank you, Bonfire Buddies, Tavius TV, Boogie Gang, Reckless Weasel with the big donations and tips and goodies. JD, Zoider Arg, Not Screamo, The Real Dinotron, and many more, guys. Thank you all for your recent support on the match, you know. All right, you're back in there. Got yep. Fluxways versus Sean. Wow. Nice. Nice uppercut. I know. Nice everything that Sean is doing right now. Using those daggers just to keep him at the right spacing. He only has one left though, so he can't be too greedy with them. Yes. Well played. Very dangerous with Flux. Ooh, the X Kunai. Yeah, well played. Guess the mark done. Guess it's done. Wow, he pressed a button. Shot. Yeah, the lady costume looks sick. I agree. She actually looks like a different character. Almost makes you think of tech and outfits. Nice. Oh, man. Shine's in there. Cool, he got He's this in stuff. there. Shine, quick, guys. The power of a ninja. Let me see some Abukis in the chat. Who's got the Abukis for me? He was in the blender. Thank you, 40 millimeter Round ray gun. One. Thanks for the support, my friend. I appreciate the 68 eons of support. No bookies, no mix. Nobody likes the bookies. There you go. That's the punish. That was punish. That's a punish, yeah, yeah. Yes, punish. excellent. He stunned his high, too. He's got it all back. Mm -hmm. They get in with the jump HP. Molotov cancel. Wow. Nice job from Shine there. Yeah, really opened them up with the pain traps. Point. Press the button to have the negative two situation. But it still worked out for him thanks to the trade. Heart rate again. That could nice have been defensive options for Shine. Mm -hmm. You need two heart rates, and that's all the damage you took. You gotta be feeling pretty good. Right there. Upper. Okay, he's looking good. He's looking good this round. A lot of frame traps. Shine does not want a reversal. No. He's chilling. Not. Right there. Right there. Uh -huh. No. Okay, airborne. airborne, so yes. it hit wrong. Round over, just like that. Final round. Still though, that sweep curse, smash right. strong. Shine can make it a sweep right now. Got his daggers back. He's trying to make sure he's fully stopped. Good choice, yeah, that didn't nice. have a good time. What a read. That was big. Mm -hmm. Slaps. Plus. Plus waves. Commanding right now. Heart rate again and again. No, oh, that's why he didn't want to do it. Ooh, how do I block? But he still needs much more than this. He doesn't have an EX for an EX kunai. But he still got in with the regular kunais. Took away all that stun with the V reversals. Mm. Smart defense from Flux Waves there. Poison wins. All right, flux waves. Yeah, the curse was not strong enough to take him out here. We'll see how Shine answers back in game three. No switch. We're sticking to the plan. Fight. 
one to one is the score between Flux Waves and Lord Shine. His Abuki has a cape. Full reversal mix. Oh my god. Nice, nice shot. That's so hard to block. Damn. <laughs> That's why I go so crazy whenever I see item block that mix. Yeah, he got the hit. And Ooh. the right up. That was a cool nice back though. Broken neck. Oh, he's sitting with the pixel, within a pixel. But he has. He has options. He has a way to come back. Hard rate again. No, the shimmies are not working. I mean, he's willing to block it out. Even if he gets back though and he's still alive, so it's like whatever, you know. You just take that. And V reversal, reversal only when he wants plus frames. Like right there. That was a great use of V reversal. Now he has to play neutral again. He's out of and kunai. Flux can't though. trade. He is out of kunai, so this is bad. And he's out of yes. resources. Mm -hmm. This is this is dangerous for both of them. Well, he has That's a viewer versus again. He has a viewer versus again. Whip or something like that, a random crouch HP, anything, and all that gray is gone. Oh. <laughs> no, oh, did any air? Did it work? This is so dangerous. Can you? Oh, viewer versus nice again for a knockdown. <gasps> yeah, yeah, he spent yeah, exactly. the daggers. Yeah. Woo! Yeah. He needed those pretty bad. You know, a second when, you know a second when when that happened, Bro. it was gonna be. <laughs> he was definitely gonna, be gonna tough. try to run away with some daggers if he had to. Wake up buttons from Shine. Ouch. Rush down central. Style combos, because why not? Oh my goodness. Mall. Shine takes it. Good stuff. Damn, that was a great you set, but win. Shine made some very good choices in game number three, especially. That first round was hype. Woo! All right, guys. So Shine is going to be the one to make it to the top eight winner's side. Yo, that means that you got to fight Shine, I think. Yeah. Shout out to Will Ty for the uh, gift subs as well on my stream. Gifted hey, three subs. Thank you, Will Ty, for hooking up Lord Art with some subs, bro. Very kind of you, my thank friend. You. Thank you. Thank you. So, guys, we got even more quarterfinals coming up. Stick around if you want to see more of them. In the meantime, if you're enjoying the great level of play and all the amazing matches here to start us off for 2021 at Nexo Battle Circuit, please check out that match from your crowdfund, guys. A lot of you have been contributing like crazy, and we appreciate it, but we could always use more, fellas. Use the codes. Use the goodies. Buy some goodies in the marketplace also if you want to help out and support. And last but not least, we always appreciate the homies that donate directly. Thanks a lot, guys. Thanks to Visualizer. Thank you, Queen Julia up in here. We see you. Reckless Weasel, Vincentius1NG, and Jungle Japes, our top contributors. But there have been many more using the codes and goodies, guys. We got Black Magic Lloyd, Tiger Knee, a Hedgehog. Okay, he's just a Hedgehog. Bonfire Buddies, Tavius, Get Ya, Boogie Gang, Reckless Weasel, JD, Zoider Arg, Not Screamo, and many more. Here you all are, guys, all the contributors tonight. Thanks for your support. On snap, I see Venom Bite. What's up in there? Many more. Cool, guys. Looks like the players are about ready. This one looks like it's Prophet versus Ludovic. Looks like Prophet is going to be on the player one side. Ludovic will be on player two. And this is also to get into the top eight on the winner's side, everybody at home. Jump to the back, Art. Oh, yes, sir. Thanks, brother. All right, let's do it, guys. Wish them both luck. We'll see who's going to get into the top eight. Profit versus Ludovic coming up. Let's do this. Use those predictions well, everybody at home. Thanks for your support. Next match is coming up. <laughs> yeah, you know, I talked about that outcasted. Sometimes that happens is that you're already following the channel. Uh, also, what will happen is sometimes you are you don't get notifications. So even when I go live and you're following, you don't get the notifications. So sometimes you have to unnotify and then turn notifications back on. That seems weird, but that's the only thing I know if that fixes that it, sadly.
Round one. Thanks for the last sub. I just got as well. Hell yeah. Who was it? Oh, pop. It was pop. It was pop or something. The name scrolled too fast. Oh, somebody just gifted subs. Whoever's gifting subs to my channel, thank you. Hey, go check Shout it out. out. Bro. Let us know who it is. Yeah. I want to know. I don't have to tell you the time. It was. VG Hero. Oh, hell blessing yeah. Me. VG Hero, the god. Yes. Thank you. Yeah, VG, VG Hero. Hero, blessing me. Yeah, same deal, a beautiful monster. What I just said, my friend. The best thing you do if that's happening to you is, is click on the bell and turn off notifications and then turn them right back on. That may help. I think it has to do with how old the channel is. We've been around since before there was Twitch. Yeah. Sometimes there's bugs yeah. and things that don't work right. Yep. Ten years at this point. I think it's, it's past 11, bro. It's almost 12 now. Oh, yeah, yeah. Yeah. <laughs> Blow up. Yeah, bro. It's been a while. 21, man. Yeah. 10 years was like 2019 or something around that time. Thank you, Auto Matok, for your support, my friend. All love to you, brother. Yo, like, <laughs> my goodness. He's living by a pixel. Living by a pixel, man. He's trying to survive, though. He has a V trigger and he has a critical art. A V trigger combo and then a critical art is, is more than enough. That's probably why he's fighting so strong, because he knows that, too. Ooh. Nice little forward right there. Damn, kill this buff. That is light goals. You see those legs? I can see the muscle definition. Oof, wow, that beat the roundhouse? Yo, Prophet's Gill is on some shit stream. Prophet's Gill is, is ridiculous. Actually, that reminds me. I just saw him make a tweet about this matchup, like about how much he hates how about how much he hates Chun Li. Uh Prophet? Yeah. Basically. He does also have a Yurian, so I think that he plays. I'll think Yurian I'm gonna catch up on that matchup too. <laughs> so hey, you, I mean, you, you was a little tricky. Would, would, if I had those two, I would rather have Yuri. I would say most of the time. That being said, I think he plays his character just because he likes him. It's not about like, oh, I think this is better than the match. Yeah. He just likes skill. Skill is awesome. Ludo Vic closing out round number two. I like seeing people pl play what they enjoy. Don't hold a grudge, okay? Don't hold a grudge. <laughs> wow. <laughs> he said, don't hold a grudge, okay? Yeah, bro. You watch, she got the Sailor Moon earrings on. Don't hold the grudge, okay? Yeah. Those are most definitely Crescent Moon Good conversion from Prophet. Yes. And he gets the Retribution. Get off me. Yeah, he, he did get off. Nice. Back to playing this neutral. Big jump in from Prophet. Oh my goodness. Got the corner. He didn't get he did, but the trade got him out of Retribution. Oh, Corey. And the EX legs getting him out of there. Oh, press your buttons. Press your buttons after that air leg. It is negative two. Time to guess. Time to guess. Yeah, no, you guess can't wrong. Press, you cannot press a button. There. Can't do that. Only guilt things. Profit game number Kill one. Uh, Profit's ridiculous stream. Time to return to harmony. Yo, I hope we see that one. Profit <laughs> All right, game number two is coming up momentarily, everybody. Whenever PS4 decides to catch up, I guess, or something, is that what it's waiting for? Mm -hmm. There we Round go. One. All right. Blah. Fight. Game number two is now in the Profit up against Ludovic. Uh, yes, MJ Savage. I have checked this recently, and she still has the most outfits in the game. By, like... Eight or something like that? Eight or nine? Nice. Pyrokinesis. My suit? Oh, he activated it. Yeah. They don't want to take the plus nine situation, so you reverse it right there. Mm. Makes sense to me. Nice hit to her. Only one meter for the combo. Nice break. Pyro. 
Nice. Nice. That was nice. The EX got him right through. Eight seconds. Ludovic almost got in with. Nice patience. Blood. Yes. Three seconds on the clock. The low shore finds its mark. That's good kung fu. Round two. Right, he needs this round to stay in it. Otherwise, he will be has to lose a side of rocket. That's a little bit. Uh, bye bye, jacket. Now she looks like the homegirl from Street Fighter EX. Yeah, a little bit. Toss. Nice, good EX. Pressure buttons again. His throws have been good. So when he's going for the air legs, you know, I assume he's trying to bait a grab. But you know, unfortunately they block it, put you in negative two. Alright, Chun Li's turn. Great spacing. Shout out to Chris Hu. What's up, man? What's up, Chris? Right now, we're watching a great match between the homie Prophet and Ludovic. Prophet opted to go with his guild. He's locked in, I think, at this. No, he's not locked in. But, but Ludovic needs this round. That part is important. Otherwise, we might see some guild in top eight, maybe. Thank you, Ikenos. Thanks, Ikenos, for the 10 eons of support. A lot of good sense. Ludovic's getting the best of it, though. If it stays a footsie war like this, he will win just by the nature of the matchup. Ooh. Huh, I think I set up after this again. Time to guess. Still guessing. I think he gets one more. Yeah, no. There we go. Oh, you low shorts out of there. Mm -hmm. Neutral. Ooh! Oh, I don't arc. think it's enough though. That's a, it's a low damage in super. That's gonna be close. He He's alive. Did not tap. That's plus when you do it like that on the way down. When you do up to down. I think. You need that momentum from the jump. It's the point nice, that matters. Short I think. Again. And that's excellent. Ludovic. He's gonna tie it up one to one. Wow, it's only one to one. Wow. Felt like <laughs> three games. That was a really slow paced match. You don't always see that in Street Fighter 5. I guess so. The chat's talking about it. That must have happened just now. That, that can't so be sad. him because that's not how global emotes work. That means that somebody else that killed his emotes. That's not how global emotes work, chat. Just so you know. <laughs> yeah, it's kind of. Wait. That might, we might try. just need a refresh. I don't see it. That either. might be all it is. I don't see it either. Sure, but sometimes when you refresh the chat, it's just that something is temporarily gone. So let's see. So, I don't know, man. Let's see. I'm going to refresh. It's got a crazy mean, out there on, on these Hey, well, sheets. you know. Never know. No, I guess so. Oh, but Ryan F. Ryan says, see, that's what I'm saying. That's oh, not him wow. that, that did that, bro. When that when it's a global emote, that means Twitch did that. Wow. <laughs> Crazy times we live in, man. I'm just trying to fix the Street Fighter 5 on Netplay, NLBC online. <laughs> Even Chris who said that is crazy. Cr it, that's cr bro, that's crazy. I can't even think about this. It is match. Crazy. That's crazy. If you think about it, the FPC has used match. that emote for years and years and years, bro. Oh. Everybody uses fuck. I mean not just oh. FPC, but that is pretty crazy. Oh Cadell, I don't want to start drama. I'll just say, man, you gotta you gotta nothing. yeah, just yeah. look up Gutex if you wanna know why there's Gutex drama. That's all it takes. It'll take you about five seconds to figure it out. One to one again is the score everybody between yeah, Profit yeah, and Ludo Vic. It's an extremely close set. They're trying to play the fireball war. Yep. The match was so epic that Pork Champ yeah. disappeared in the middle of it. Yeah, exactly. Ludo Vic takes round number one. Round two. Fight. I'll forever know this as the match where Pork Champ died. Yeah. Yeah. Um, exactly. <laughs> Dude. 
Great spacing right now from Ludovic. Mm -hmm. And right now, these guys are playing neutral. Oh, but the stand show is such a godlike in here. Yeah. Oof, big stand fierce. CA. This is significant damage, too. but... But Prophet has most of his comeback factor. And, oh my god! god that's it, that's it. Oh, Molding. Nice job, Ludovic. Ooh, okay, she has those. <laughs> Good shit, Ludovic. All right. So Ludovic is the one that's going to advance over Prophet. That was a lot of fun to see his great guild gameplay. Unfortunately, he was defeated. Ludovic fought quite strong there. And he's going to take it 2-1, to one, everybody. We got even more matches coming up, fellas. Actually, there should be at least one more quarterfinal that you guys are going to get to see. So stick around for that one. Let's see who's in it for all of you. Looks like we got Metro M versus the homie Pink, guys, that we're going to see shortly. We'll see who's going to show up between those two homies. Yeah, it's true, Dr. Steve. We've been talking about it the whole time in the match. You can tell us how you feel in the in the chat, fellas, whether you're happy or whether you're sad or anything else. It seems like everybody wants to talk about it. It is an emote that we all use quite a lot, myself included. So I understand. Let us know how you feel, fellas. The winner of that last match was... Ludovic, 2-1. to one. It was a close match. I had to take a moment to even remember. All right, guys. It looks like Pink is going to be player one and Metro M is going to be player two. So let's get that in there for all of you. Good luck to both players, of course. Support the match with a crowdfund, guys, if you've been enjoying yourselves tonight. We appreciate it. Use that code, saving up BC 152 No, that's not how global emotes work. Just to explain, global emotes can only be decided by Twitch. So when Twitch decides that something special enough has happened, they make a global emote for it. In the case of the Pog Champ, they made that global emote based on an old advertisement that him and Mike did. If you guys remember, it was a very famous advertisement. Uh, and that's where the Pog Champ emote came from. Wow. That tweet is spreading like wildfire. Yeah, bro. I mean, Twitch. not a surprise. All right, let's go. So the homies are here. Lord, all right, let's jump to the back so they can get ready. Uh, no, I'm just going to tell the guys to support the match arena and all that stuff, basically. But uh, let's do this match first, guys. Pink up against Metro M. We'll set our predictions for all of you as usual. This is match number 10 that you guys are going to see. Crazy. The news is happening even even while we're having a tournament. The news is happening all around us, guys. Pretty wild. Grinning Oni. Thank you for your support, Grinning Oni. Thank you also, Gem262, for giving away a sub. Both of you guys are awesome. Thank you, fellas. You might have got us. We might be past our goal already of 1,400. I haven't even been paying attention because you guys have been incredible. Support the match, you know, guys. Thanks for $279 up in there. That definitely means that we got some recent contributors and supporters. Fight. Including Nomadic Nut. Thank you, Nomadic Nut, who's a long... Been supporting oh, huge lately. He gave $50 tonight, Nomadic Nut, to hook it up. Thank you, Nomadic Metro, Nut. Metro on PC. Yep. He just switched recently. We were talking Everybody about making that earlier. switch. Yeah, it seems like it. Seems like people are Welcome finally tired of the PS4. Race. They don't have to do it, and they're. Welcome to the master race. Mm -hmm. The race of, of low latency. I mean, whatever, Space Boy. PC is still better in the long run, right? If you can have a better, better in the long run. Yeah, if you can have a better connection on PC. Awesome. Why it's not? just the, the the only thing it's it's not that good for is offline versus. But guess what? Can't play offline. There's not really very much of that right now, so. Yeah. Pink the God. Again, he's got the Coldine so far tonight. Pink Coldine because, you know, teams. Very nice right there from Punk. Yep. It's one of our standard V-Trigger extensions. Still does a grip. Oh, hell no, Shinku 101. If you went 2 and 2, yeah. you should probably feel pretty good about yourself. This is not an easy tournament, to say the least. Yeah, it's, it's not. Definitely really difficult. <laughs> you get bodied at this tournament. 2 and 2 means you know how, what to improve on, if anything. Take a look at those losses hard, and try your best to get better next week, brother. And thanks for your support, Shinku 101. Something like that, AA Shen, I guess.
Wow, that interrupted? Crazy. He's, he's scooping them all over the place. If he gets freeze right now, it's bad news. Stun cannot dissipate because he's in free state. So he must approach. He finally got the hit. Jab, jab, nothing. Over it. Good block. Yeah, great block, but he's too far to punish. Oh. The flip. I'm not sure. He hit it anyway. He's the... Oh, he's dead. He's dead. Damn. I had a couple of questions there about um, the meter, but Punk just answered that. Colleen wins. Good stuff right there. Oh, I'm sorry, K Dive. <laughs> Rip. No, that's sad. What if Metro plays OD though? Yeah. Round one. What if he just wins? That would be Fight. sick. Alright. Pink player one, Metro's player two. Pink took the first one. Uh, 2 0 was telling me just now how he wanted to see. I can't even just describe it, it's pretty funny. He wanted to see an all blind characters tournament, but only the naturally blind characters, not the characters that have a blind outfit. Damn. <laughs> <laughs> oh, wow. what was that? You that can do sick. that? <laughs> I'm like, yeah, she can do whatever. She, she's skating, man. She's skating. Yo, why, why do 20 wants. people not play this character every tournament? I don't understand. Yeah, she's, uh, yeah I think she's so. I strong. don't get it. He's so strong. You see this control? Oh, finally, right as I say that, he gets back down. He's gonna get punished here. Yes. Medium punish. Mm -hmm. Gonna get now some set play. Corner. But he back dashes, back dash. actually. Yeah, stand fierce is just it's such a good button. And that's why I stand strong. You gotta punish from that far. That punish was so good. Oh my goodness. Nice he tried jab to check. More. Yeah, he needs to she beat the trigger. She beat he all his clothes off. Did anybody see that? Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> he lost his mask and his clothes. Yo, the whiff Damn. punish. OD. Oh. OD. <laughs> Bro. Colleen. <laughs> Yo, Colleen went up in his house. <laughs> it robbed everything. Everything was robbed. Robbed the mask. Robbed the claw. Robbed the 2-0. And he guaranteed himself a spot in the top eight winner's side. <laughs> well, guys, that was another sweep, everybody. It's sweep number seven of the evening for Lord Punk. It's not over for Metrum, guys, so don't worry. He definitely has a very strong chance of making it out on the loser's side of the bracket. Stick around if you want to see even more action. That was sweep number seven. Thank you to everybody that watched the pools portion of Nexo Battle Circuit Online Edition. I appreciate all of you guys. If you guys watched it here on Twitch, don't forget to give us a follow. And also make sure you have those notifications on. That way you know whenever we're live. And to everyone that's watching this on YouTube, make sure to give us a follow here on YouTube. Don't forget to leave a comment. And also YouTube monsters, make sure to also watch out for the top eight bot that you'll also find here on YouTube.com slash TeamSweep.